Hello. It is good to see you here in Port Last, my friend. If we are to have any luck in tracking down this strange cult behind the plague, it will be with your aid, I am sure. I do not know how much you have been told about Lord Nash's orders. I shall help you understand whatever I can, certainly. How I feel is unimportant next to the mission we have been given. Please allow me to explain what is required of us. You know, of course, that Dester and... and Fendik were associated with some manner of religious cult that was behind the Wailing Death in the city. We know so little about this cult, and it would be foolish in the extreme to suppose that, simply because their activities in Neverwinter have been stopped, that they have been defeated. Lord Nasher commands that we track down the headquarters of this cult and discover their plans and stop them before another atrocity is committed. Erin Gend, Lord Nasher's spymaster, is here in Port Last to help us do this and has brought reports of many strange activities throughout the Northern Lands. It is possible that agents of the cult may be behind some of these activities. If so, we may be able to find them and discover where their base is located. Your aid in this will prove invaluable. Aye, it is, as I am sure you can well imagine. Fenthic, my only love, dead at the hands of my lawful liege. His true murderers, however, lie invisibly beyond my reach. I wish, with such fervor that it frightens me, to see those allies of Desta pay, to see Tyr visit them with terrible justice. I am a paladin of Tyr, sworn to uphold good and justice, yet somehow I cannot condemn Fenthic in my heart. He meant only to do what he saw was his duty, I am sure of it. I thank you. That is kind of you to say. My own loss seems insignificant, however, compared to Benthic's disgrace. It... Ah, oh, but I should not be distracting you from your task. My own problems are unimportant and of no interest to you, I am sure. Please forgive me. It... It is just that Benthic's fate could have been mine, or yours, or anyone's. How do you know that the path you walk is the correct one? I have never questioned my faith or my duty before, but neither did Fenthic. I feel doubt, and I am ashamed to admit it. Perhaps I am merely wallowing in my sorrow. Perhaps I know my path better than I think I do, but I am no longer sure. Is it wrong for me to think such thoughts? Yet I have no answers. Only more questions. <sighs> Thank you for allowing me to unburden my heart. But perhaps it is best if I put these thoughts out of my head for now. The safety of Neverwinter relies on your mission, and my duty regarding that is more than clear. Let us speak of that instead. Of course, ask what you will of me. I am here to see that Lord Nash's commands are carried out, while Eren continues to use his network of spies to gain more information beyond Neverwinter's walls. Admittedly, my own role seems sparse. Part of me thinks that my Lord Nasher simply wishes someone he trusts in this role, while another believes he does not wish to be reminded of Benthic or my pain. Regardless, we will do all that we can to help you. Do not think your efforts go unrecognized. Any information you discover should be brought to Eren and myself. Once we know more about the cult, Lord Nasher can decide what to do next. Eren has several ideas on places where the cult may be hidden. Currently, he is working on finding a way into the city of Luskin. Its gates have been sealed since the plague in Neverwinter began. I suggest you talk to Eren about where these places might be. Search for any clues about the rise of ancient cults or odd activities. Once a way into Luskin is found, you can search there as well. If we are fortunate, you will perhaps encounter some part of the cult and gain information as to who they are and where they are based. 
The search does continue within the city. Indeed, Lord Nasher is having Neverwinter scoured thoroughly for more traces of the cult. It is his feeling, however, that the true force of the cult lies outside of Neverwinter, and that it is your efforts here that will prove the most valuable. Dester appears to have been their link in Neverwinter, as you discovered. But of the cult itself, we have been able to ascertain little. Erin is positive that its true heart lies outside of Neverwinter, and that it has yet to show us the extent of its strength. The task ahead of us will no doubt be most dangerous, but that makes it all the more necessary that we do not remain ignorant of what this cult is and what it intends. Certainly. I would suggest you speak to Erin Gend and find out where to focus your efforts in finding evidence of the cult. Well now, if it isn't you, glad I am to see you. Isn't the country wonderful this time of year? So much better than the city with all that, um, burning and dying. You know. Eh? What can Tommy do for you? I suppose you're here to sign up, I. I've no time for a new apprentice, however, so off you go. friend. You were instrumental in ridding Neverwinter of the wailing death, I understand. Allow me to congratulate you on a job well done. You have shown yourself to be possessed of remarkable courage and resourcefulness. That is fortuitous, for both these qualities will be needed if you are to complete your mission. But that is not how we should begin. I am known as Aaron Gen, and I have served our Lord Nasher for some time. Hopefully, I may be of similar use to you now. Indeed, I know who you are. There are many who whisper your name right now, and it is my business to listen to them all. My place lies in the shadows. I have many eyes and ears throughout the northern lands, and it is my place to inform Lord Nasher where the vipers lay in wait. If only I had foreseen the actions of this cult, I could have prevented the disaster. But these men move skillfully out of my sight and hearing. Instead of recriminating myself for my failure, I must do what I can to repair the damage. And that is to offer what information I have to you, 
so that you may find where this new nest of vipers hides. Erebeth has informed you of where you must search, yes? She has... Unearthing the cult will not be a simple task. What few whispers I have collected, however, have allowed me to narrow your search to this region. It is vital that the cult's exact location be found, and that we are certain any leads we discover are not attempts at deception. Erebeth will not be satisfied until we find at least two separate leads that point to the same locale. That is your task. I do know of one possible lead for you. There has been strange news regarding a series of caves that lie north of Port Last. Investigation may reveal the cult to be hidden there. If not, there are other avenues for you to investigate. The city of Luskin to the north, Neverwinter Wood to the east, and the Wildlands of the South Road. I suggest, however, that looking into the caves first would still be your wisest choice. The caves are in the hills to the north of Port Last, near the Green Griffin Inn. They have long been used by humanoid tribes of orcs, bugbears, and the like. They aren't usually a concern. In recent months, however, I have received word that these various humanoid creatures have been raiding the roads south of Luskin. This would not be unusual, except that the creatures now seem very organized and, I hear, are being led by humans. This leads me to believe the cult may be involved. That will be for you to determine. Just keep this in mind. No matter what you find there, Erebeth will wish two firm leads on the cult's location before she will act. We cannot afford a mistake. Have you a question for me then, my friend? As you wish. I, a city of pirates and base villainy. The city itself will be closed to you now, but it will be worth your while to go in that direction anyway. You should seek out the humanoid caves by the Green Griffin. Their gates have been sealed ever since the plague began in Neverwinter, I'm afraid. The city is quite anarchic. An outbreak there would be devastating indeed. I have been attempting to pull what strings I can to convince officials in Luskin that the plague is over. But I am having little luck so far. Before the gates closed, there were rumors of battles in the streets in Luskin. Who knows what transpires there? With luck, I will soon arrange you a way inside to investigate. Evil men are common as coins in Luskin, my friend. This cult could walk the streets unnoticed and find many allies who would heed gold above all else. The fact that the city remains sealed even now that the plague has ended, and so little word escapes its walls, has me worried of what events transpire there. Additionally, I have been troubled by reports of humanoid banditry taking place on the road between Neverwinter and Luskin. This is unusual, and while it may simply be caused by Luskin's ignorance, it should be investigated. As you wish. One of the deepest and most ancient woods of the north, my friend. It is filled with life both beautiful and dangerous, and is tended to by the Order of Druids. The Arts Druid Awil has sent several letters to Lord Nasher as of late, begging for aid against some unknown force that assails the wood. Lord Nasher would have provided the help the Arts Druid required, but could not due to the chaos within the city. Neverwinter must come first. Awil has sent no more messages in recent days, and it is possible that the druids exist no more. The exact danger that was being faced was not explained. This cult may not even be involved. It may, however, so this may be an excellent avenue for you to search. Follow the road east of Port Last. The lands are wild and sparsely populated there, and when you reach the boundaries of the Great Forest, you will know, as you wish. I will certainly tell you all I know about the other places you may need to search. The road leads eventually home to Neverwinter, but before that lay many miles of wildlands, as well as the village of Charwood. The cult could hide in many places there. The southern road is not so much a place you go to, my friend, as it is a route you take. It will lead you eventually to Neverwinter, but it is the region itself that concerns me. I have no reports from this area. None. This disturbs me perhaps more than it should, as the cult could exist openly here, and I would not even know. I offer the South Road as a possibility mostly out of speculation, my friend. I simply would not wish to leave it out entirely, just in case my suspicions have good reason. As you wish.
I will certainly tell you all I know about the other places you may need to search. There are locals who could tell you more of this town, my friend. My knowledge of it is limited. I did my best to investigate Port Last before we made our base here, my friend. But what you suggest is not impossible. There may have been things ongoing in this place which escaped my notice. An investigation on your part is not without merit. May the luck of the gods be yours, my friend. Hi there. Everything happens. 
happens for a reason, it does. Thanks so much for helping me, Al Hello. Hey, LTE! You. you must be new in these parts.
Can I help you? I told you I never want to see you again. Go away. As I like to say, I am Eltura Subtil, and a finer collection of wares you are not apt to find. Greetings. Yeah. 
Ah, no can do. No can do. Hello. I greet you. Turns my attack. Hi there. Hi there. Okay, okay. Uh, 
Okay, okay. I greet you. It's done. there to you. My name is Ballard. I'm looking for someone interested in a dangerous mission. Might you be interested? It's done.
be down. So straight. Yes, hello to you.
Ah, uh, it's done. Both walk away from this. No can do. It's done.
So strange. Yes.
my steel will strike true. It's done. this.
We won't both walk away from this. Some sorcery turns my attack. Some sorcery turns my attack. Some sorcery turns my attack. You will regret that. Ugh.
Okay, okay.
Ah, uh, it's done. Okay, turkey. my attack. So strange. Hey, I'll tell you. Come on, 
both walk away from this. Perhaps I was too rash in attack. Please, accept my apology. Okay, okay.
Have you managed to kill the imp and close the portal? Hey, hey. 